I don't really sort of recommend one method or another to anybody. I'm not the kind of doctor that's going to say, this is the method that you should use and here's why. Um, but I do offer um, the IUD or Nexplanon, I do offer LARC methods to all of my patients. Um, I think number one, it's really important not to be complacent, so that if somebody comes in for an annual exam and you're gonna refill her pill, I think that we should readdress it every year rather than just refilling what they're already using and just double checking that that's still okay for them and reminding them that their risk of failure is about one out of 10. Um, Cause maybe they didn't know and maybe they started the pill with a different doctor that didn't offer them LARC methods. So I think it's important to readdress um, even in just a quote unquote routine annual exam. Um, I follow ACOG guidelines when it comes to who's an IUD candidate. So that includes women that have never had a, a child and a woman does not have to be in a monogamous relationship.